a YouTube channel or something. I have. You, you give yeah. off like a YouTube vibe. You give off like a vibe that says, oh, hello, I have a YouTube channel. You like, you know, that's the vibe that I get from you. <laughs> like, I'm a cool Thank YouTube. You. Okay, that's great. Okay. That's great. <laughs> That is good. Um, so, you know, by our, like, what, um, two minute, not even two minutes, like one minute conversation, I know that you have a good hold over English. So I'm guessing this is just going to be like a gen- Hello. Hello. Hi, Rachel. Hey. I'm doing good. Hi. Uh, did you ask me if I was doing good? <laughs> I didn't ask, but I'll ask you right now. Okay, okay. No, because I, I, I thought like I heard you say, how are you? Uh, I'm doing good. How are you doing? I'm also doing good, yeah. So today was the first day of Ramadan. Yeah. So oh, it was yeah, good. It was good, yeah. That's, that's great. Yeah. That's great. So could you just, would you like to tell me about yourself? I know that you had to introduce yourself with like a lot of people and by now Wrong. you must be bored. So if you don't want to do it, we could skip it. But if you want to, then yeah, yes. I'm for it. Yeah, so I'll uh, summarize it it quickly. <laughs> for sure, for sure. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, hi, my name is Faraz. I'm an English house graduate. And uh, uh, it's been almost a month, maybe more than that, with Clappingo. And uh, awesome. yeah, and uh, I love to play guitar and I have interest in music. I love reading, though, as I'm an English house graduate. So, <laughs> I've adopted this habit for like, it's been a long time now. And uh, yeah, okay. I love it. I love interacting with new people, and uh, yeah. Okay, that's great. Okay. That's great. <laughs> yeah. That is good. Um, so you know, by our like what um two minute, not even two minutes, like one minute conversation, I know that you have a good hold over English. So I'm guessing this is just going to be like a general conversation with us. And if you have to make a mistake, then you know yeah, I could sure. point it out. Looking yeah? forward to it, definitely. Awesome. So what would you like to talk about? Uh, could you tell me more about your hobbies? Absolutely. So uh, there are so many hobbies which I have. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And if I have to name some of them. Uh, so the first one would be reading. And I love okay. to listen to music. And mm-hmm. I love to play guitar as I have mentioned it. Uh, and I sing as well. Not a great singer though, but yeah, as I play guitar. Do I you have, have like a YouTube channel or something? <laughs> I have, I have. But you uh, do. You give yeah. off like a YouTube vibe. You give off like a vibe that says, "Oh, hello, I have a YouTube channel." You like, you know, that's the vibe that I get from you. <laughs> like, I'm a cool Thank YouTuber. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. I, but yeah. I do have it. Yeah. Uh, so okay. the awesome. name is Better English with Faraz. So I keep posting uh, videos on that uh, channel. So okay. my, my main motto is to, of course, because it's been a long, uh, quite a while now that I've been working uh, okay. and I'm talking to international clients. It's been almost uh, six, seven years, maybe, or maybe more than that, that I've been talking, like I've been in the voice uh, processes. Uh, okay. so since then, I have been wor- working on my communication skills. And uh, mm-hmm. so as I have been working from home and uh, now uh, what my motto is to become a public speaker as I love interacting. And okay. uh, so, so that is my uh, main goal. And and I love to teach as well. So, and I, what I want to do is that I don't, I want to uh, do my own thing. That is my uh, main motto. So for okay. that, so for that, I uh, want to make sure that I reach at some level to, to that level where I can be called as a Polish speaker that I have a very good command over the language uh, so that I can also teach people and uh, groom them as well. So, yeah. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay, that's good. Um, that's a very nice goal to have. I do appreciate that. So usually what I do is, you know, I ask the people how they are and then I go into the question. So what are you struggling with English? How could I help today? And then they state whatever their problem is. And post that, I always give them like two, not really rules, but I do uh, tell one thing is that, uh, you know, if I'm talking too fast because I do have a habit, people have told me that sometimes I can speak a little bit fast. So if I do speak fast, then just like, you know, approach me and tell me not to or ask me to repeat it and I'll do that even if it's a hundred times until our session is still on. And the second thing is, 
uh, I appreciate all the learners who come up and who actually, you know, want to learn because first is it's not easy. It does take a certain amount of courage. So I do appreciate them. And uh, for us, I do appreciate you for coming out here and, you know, for being a clapping go for like a month or so and for learning so yeah. much. I can see that you have a really good vocabulary and this is like, you know, a really good conversation that we are having because I can really understand what you're saying. And I think you should also appreciate yourself. I think you do that as well, right? <laughs> I, I certainly do it. And thank you so much for motivating me. And it doesn't really feel like <laughs> I'm having the uh, conversation with you for the very first time. So it it really <laughs> so I'm having yeah. uh, I'm I'm it getting that, that helps like, me <laughs> a positive vibe. So yeah, that is indeed a good thing. <laughs> okay, <laughs> thank you, thank you. Yeah. Um. Okay. So I'll just tell you a little about me. So you know, it's not just a one way conversation. <laughs> um. So basically, I'm from Bangalore. Okay. Okay. And uh, I can't think as a business development manager for an international company. And I completed my bachelor's in commerce. So I have specialized in sales and marketing. And that's what I like to do. Um, okay. I don't really have hobbies. I do play the ukulele. But it's really? like very restricted, you know, like once in like three it? months, I'm like, okay. Yeah, I do. I do. You have it home? I'm more okay. of a singer. Uh, yeah, I do have it. Uh, Great. Yeah, yeah. And uh, yeah, I, yeah, that's pretty much about me. Like, and I'm also a solo traveler. I do enjoy traveling as well. That is like a passion to me. Traveling is something else to me. <laughs> yeah. To, to some extent, I also share the same hobbies. I think, that, okay, no, I thought you were stuck. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was saying, is it, where are you China? from, by the way? So my roots are from UP and I was yeah, born and raised in Delhi. Oh, okay, okay. That's cool. That's cool. So, uh, and right now I'm living in Greater Noida earlier. You must have heard about Jamia. Earlier I was living there. So, I've recently been shifted to Greater Noida. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So, the solo, ta- okay. uh, so you uh, told me about your, uh, one of your hobbies that you like solo traveling. I also really like that. Oh, you also solo travel? Yes, yes. I, I That's do. So great. And I, because I'm a biker too. And I, oh. I like the biking. I like, I've never joined any biker groups and all. So I ride solo. Yeah. But isn't it like, aren't you afraid that, you know, suddenly in the midst of nowhere, your bike might stop, but I think, yeah, you might. That change. is fun. Yeah. Because you don't yeah, have it's... to plan actually. If you like, if you're planning, so <laughs> what's the point? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah, that does make sense. It's like spontaneous. Yeah. So I would be spontaneous if it just came to like traveling, like pack your bags, take a flight, take a train, bus or whatever. Of course, not now, but like before. <laughs> uh, but like when it comes to a bike or something like that, I'm a bit scared. I do also know how to ride the bike as well. Um, I don't own to one. I don't own one. Yeah. So, yeah, these are the things that, that you know, uh, differentiate yourself from others and... Uh, this is one thing which I really like because I don't go out much and like I am referring uh, this thing in the context of like I don't party and all and and I don't like being uh, you know going to uh, uh, for. Uh, I think you don't like wasting your time. Like you're a person who likes to be productive, right? Use right, your time wisely. Right, right, right. Or yeah, yeah. even if I have to stay home, I I really like spending quality time with my family. That is the best time Same. that I have. So yeah, yeah. yeah, and and apart from that, if I have to go out, Maxim, I'll go out with my elder brother. Like uh, he has a bike, <laughs> he is a bike enthusiast. Uh, okay. Him, I uh, same is with me, and uh, like apart from that, I you know uh, stay home <laughs> and I oh. read. And I, yeah, yeah. Apart from that, I and uh, I'm a movie buff, film buff. Okay. So, okay. Yeah, I really That's like cool. uh, spending that time. You know, what my, is your in, favorite in film? Which film has been the favorite film that you've watched like recently off late uh so because it's been a while now that that i had uh, watched any movie but i can tell you my uh, favorite movie that is one is goodwill hunting matt matt damon is there okay okay 
Yeah, okay. So, so he is a great mathematician. Like like he is <laughs> like he is a very okay. And uh, Robin Williams is there. And yeah. uh, and uh, the uh, movie is uh, Ghosts in the Darkness. Ghosts in the Darkness is about uh, two okay. two lions yeah, and I'm, Tabo. I haven't heard of any of these movies. These are I mean, I'm, I'm I'm telling you. Uh, I'm more of a series person. and you know i tend to watch Which, friends on a regular basis and i repeat it like i'm watching friends all the time like all the time like it's on repeat it's pretty boring but i just do that to like relax yeah. myself because yeah i do have pretty have you watched, uh, as well have you subscribed uh, this uh, uh, platform uh, amazon prime have you subscribed it or uh, do you only follow netflix yeah yeah Yes. Both one series that I have been following on the daily basis. No, no. I mean, I do have Amazon really Prime as well, which I really like. That is uh, the Young Sheldon. It's really good. You ought to watch it if you haven't. Oh yeah, do, I like Young Sheldon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have, I have, I have. I love. It's really good. It's super entertaining, right? It is. It is. Like, like, uh, so, like yeah, he has that kind of intellect. You like yeah. when you watch it, you like. Man, I also have to read. <laughs> like you will feel like you get yeah, that feeling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like young um, Sheldon, he's too inspiring at that age, you know. He, oh, yeah, and uh, there is another series you might have watched that A Good Doctor. That is also an amazing series. Uh, my family watches that. I haven't got to that part where I've gone and watched it yet. I've recently started. Do you have like a person who uh, you look up to? Do you like? Do you enjoy stand-up comedy? That is, I know many people who don't. Yeah, so uh, I don't like you. You might find it strange that I don't follow comedy much. I I but I uh, really like fiction. Okay. Yeah, fiction is my genre, and uh, I really like uh, watching animated movies. I mean, anim- we all do have different preferences, so it's all right. That's cool. That's yeah. cool. That's really yeah. nice. That is cool as well. Awesome. Though I have two idols since my childhood. Pretty cool. Um, I'm sorry. What? Yeah, yeah. Please go ahead. You were saying something. No, you were saying something. I I couldn't like. I was saying though 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 I do have uh, two idols since my childhood. or uh, for that matter there are three idols <laughs> so one is arnold schwarzenegger second one is uh, sylvester stallone okay. and, and and third is bruce lee so since childhood i have been watching their movies and like i have been following them like anything oh that's nice that's nice i don't particularly have like idols and stuff like that um but that's cool I haven't found any idol who's been like, oh, you know, I want to follow this guy. I haven't oh, found. Oh, I'm finding. I think, I think Elon Musk definitely. Elon Musk, yeah. So yeah, I think. Of course, I I do follow him, Elon Musk. I I really follow him, and I really yeah. follow a uh, uh, Warren Buffett. And, oh uh, yeah, yeah. And Bill Gates, I follow. Even yeah, I really follow Musk. Yeah, yeah, Mark yeah he, of course. Yeah, you They're know, all, all so all inspiring, are, you know. Yeah, even Mark, Mark Zuckerberg. See, all these people yeah. are, yeah, and this Suraj uh, Panchay. Like you know, all these people are so inspiring. So you get to learn yeah. a lot from them. Their like what their journey has been, and uh, the the kind of uh, disciplined life that they lead is mm. that it's is truly, all inspiring. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that is actually. You know, it's been really long since I actually like came across a person who would follow like the same people who who would find um the discipline life like you know in all like inspiring because usually nowadays like people like just want to go out, want to party, want to chill, want to have fun, you know. Very rarely yeah. will you find people who are just like, you know, no, I want to make most of my time. I want to actually work on this. No, let me do this. So that's why, right. you know, that that's one of the reasons like it's a very tiny reason but that's one of the reasons why i appreciate all the learners because they can easily just you know be chilling somewhere else you know they can probably just go out listen right, to right. music whatever but they are taking time out to, to improve themselves 
exactly self improvement yeah self transform themselves exactly yeah, so self-improve. it's because time it's is like precious and time is money yeah a learning would yeah, be constant sure. and yeah it will be really helpful and and on my youtube channel as well and, and i have been uh, like on every video i so i put a, a very short intro on every video before the english uh, the actual english uh, conversation with the tutors which i have uh, so i yeah. put the complete uh, vi- okay. videos on my youtube channel but before that i i do put in a uh, uh, short intro wherein i tell the learners or whoever the subscriber is watching my videos so i tell them that uh, this is a thing that uh, this is my uh, journey with the uh, clapping go and uh, before clapping go as well since the time i have started working since then i mm-hmm. have been learning there is no blueprint of learning you know uh, don't go by yeah. those apps which they say you, you you'll be able to uh, learn english within 30 days i am going mm-hmm. to give you a blueprint there is no blueprint green print no <laughs> yeah. you like it does take time but as same as bodybuilding takes time you you mm-hmm. cannot build your physique within a month or two same as with the language it takes years to you know, agree. Yeah. yeah and you know people are hoax you like 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 they are like they pretend that uh, they are teaching but they are actually portraying a wrong image of the of the actual uh, tutors of the genuine uh, tutors yeah who are who yeah, are actually yeah. eager to, who are actually eager to uh, teach so yeah <laughs> yeah uh, it does take time yeah, i totally get you because this if has i been a very me, nice conversation i share the same feeling <laughs> looking forward uh, to our next conversation and i always yes. ask uh, from my every tutor before the call yes. gets started if you could just give me the quick feedback mm-hmm. whatever you think okay so um i think you are pretty confident okay like you have like a very confident vibe you know what you're going to say and uh, there is forever room for improvement like even for me there is you know room for improvement for you there is also room for improvement um the, on your vocabulary like every day you know learn new words i do that as well and i encourage all my learners to do because you can never stop learning there's no such thing as putting an end to learn we always learn we learn everything you know uh, so but i think your english is really good and uh, i wish you know um that i could have actually heard uh, could have heard you speak english like before so i could see like how much you've improved but yeah it was great you know like i didn't even have to stress on the fact that okay but what is paras trying to tell me or something like that easy going conversation and i could understand everything that you said and i'm sure you also could understand everything that i said because you responded yeah. <laughs> to that completely and uh, yeah i did have a lot of fun in this session for sure you know and i think yeah you're on the right path awesome you should really appreciate yourself really <laughs> thank you so much <laughs> this is so motivating i must say this has been a great mm-hmm. conversation looking forward to it yeah I, so uh, again, i also asked really for like, feedback <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah so uh the 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 feedback is uh, like uh, i am li- living on a positive note that uh, it is a great feedback for you that uh, the you are being uh, patient enough uh, to listen to me and i really didn't feel like that i was talking to you for the first time and uh, and you were like uh, okay you are very yeah. friendly <laughs> and, and of course you have a smiling face and you are very energetic like you were engrossed whatever i was saying you were totally engrossed in the conversation it like it it wasn't like that 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 i was just speaking and you were okay you go on so i didn't feel like uh, that but you were uh, yeah. really good and this is the reason i am really looking forward uh, for our next conversation Yeah, awesome. This is great. Thank you so and much for that. You know, we also need positive affirmation. Uh, Rachel, and I just just want to uh, confirm one thing. You know, uh, yeah. like uh, from the past two days what is happening because I had uh, booked the session with you earlier as well. But but what yeah, had happened? Yeah. But uh, wo- I don't know if it is happening with everyone. It uh, like uh, it is asking for the meeting uh, password. That is why I wasn't able to join. I I got in touch with the customer care team 
and i told them that uh, how do i get the password because uh, i joined the session but it was uh, asking for the meeting password so did you receive a password no okay so what you could do is you could reach out to the support did you reach out to the support no i i did not receive the password okay they do not uh, so do you usually have passwords every time you no, enter no. a meeting room no 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 never never okay i think it was a glitch in the system okay okay that that or, might be or yes. see if it has happened with you in like the couple of meetings i think you should get in touch with the support so what i'll do I is do i will also yeah. get in touch with someone and i will also like take this uh, query ahead so even you get in touch so we could see that you know if we can try and rectify it because i think like i guess 16, they did we have it. another call right 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 and because they did rectify it that, that is the reason why i am able to uh, talk to you oh so okay okay to go through so because they told me because i had a different session uh, today in the afternoon uh, okay. today in the evening at like by 4 or 5 so uh, for that session i like i wasn't able to uh, get through because it was oh. like possible okay yeah okay, so okay. I, so i did get in touch with the team and they told me that uh, from tomorrow onwards or uh, maybe by they'll be able to fix it by uh, today evening awesome okay so, yeah. that works as well great yeah. so i thought that i should also let you know because yeah <laughs> yeah yeah so that i'm pretty new to clapping go and i'm enjoying my time here i love what i'm doing i really love it <laughs> so yeah yeah because yeah this is also the feedback that it did like i didn't feel uh, that uh, you are new to uh, clapping go that it feels like that you have been taking sessions for quite some time now <laughs> there's also i mean the- i did get quite a lot of sessions and they all really nice like i really really love this you know because i think also like if you actually take into consideration right now the situation where you know we're all under lockdown and like covid it's pretty bad like we don't get to meet anybody we don't get to speak to anybody this is such a good platform just for people to even hear like some you know people could be staying alone and stuff like that and for them to look at another person and speak it all just means so much and i do think like you, you don't even have to uh, commute anywhere come to an end right oh yes <laughs> didn't did not even realize how i guess it may be more than 20 minutes yes. we've been talking <laughs> yes the thing is that i have another session right now so i have so far it was nice meeting you and i'm looking forward to our next session a really amazing conversation and uh, yeah take care until then okay yeah yeah, yeah. bye bye yeah okay